Hey chat, uh, post your uh, favorite emotes if you can hear me. T testing. Okay, yeah, I can hear. Cool. So we got the Steven, we got St C stat finals here. It's uh, the C stat weekly, basically. Uh, thank you, thank you. I like the dog, personally. Uh, now we got Jay Walker, Blues Clues. Jay Walker, uh, playing pretty good. Playing some DK. Bullshit. And then, of course, uh, last week he had the big mojo win. Everybody was really excited for him. Blues Clues, yeah. That single handedly, I think, redeemed all of his losses, didn't it? Yeah, that was crazy. Because he was like, I'm flubbing him. He didn't really? They were like Don, and they were like good players, you know? He was just like, why am I losing every week? And I'm just like, yeah, I know the feeling. You grab the turnip. Fox's throw is, is, is pretty good, right, as a, as a I have a throw. Oh. He's going to wait. Peach really can't do much here, so you just kind of react to it. Of course, her uh, regular get up and a roll kind of looks similar, so it's like, ah, I'll punish one and miss the other. It's scary. Just another example of the fantastic balance that went into this game to make it a competitive fighter. To rival Dragon Ball Z. When's the dojo emote? Hey, have you decided something for the dojo emote? No, he's not decided it. We're currently stuck on uh, Oscar naked, which we can, we can barely fit into the imp size. Uh, we've got Jake eating a sandwich. And uh, and then, of course, we've got Cylon uh, complaining about his hands hurting. Those are our three emotes, and we're going to find out which one is the best next week. The Jake 13 pick. Too many dark colors. Are you talking about the one that's on the banner? Oh, somebody su suggested. Oh, silencing one. Smug Ginta. I like Smug Ginta. I think that's great. I almost made a... Uh, I was messing around with GIMP because I've never done photo editing before, and I was like, oh, that's something I can learn. And I was going to make a, a Houston Melee PR banner. Uh, based on MASH, all the MASH characters. And I was going to make uh, Ginta Frank Burns. I don't know if anybody would catch or understand that reference. Uh, but that would have been funny. But no, uh, we're, we're, we're being nicer to Ginta here because because we have offended him so much he's no longer doing uh, PRs. Is he really? Oh yeah, he is uh, our current DBZ champion. I heard that game, uh, some of the combos on her are kind of auto combo. That's a good picture, but it is a lot of dark. Because of his stupid mustache. Should have told him to shave for it. Actually, I don't know. I'm chilled out on Ginta. Ginta's fine. I think a big factor that it goes to actually beating him the last time you play him, that kind of helps him better. Like, I get this. <laughs> but nothing's worse than losing to Ginta, because he will tell you that he wasn't even playing good. I bet he's good at fighters. I remember he, back when he first started playing, he was, uh, he was, uh, yeah, he's the best sack boy in, uh, PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale. Yeah, you might remember it from Evo, uh, Grand Stage, last event. Of course, Ginta single-handedly beat all of the Kratoses in the world. Oh, gets a lucky nair there. I'm not talking about this at all, I'm so sorry. But this first game's looking to go to Steven, unless, oh, the choke of the century, and no, of course, PG Down Smash kind of saves you from choking sometimes. Drop through? Okay, now he goes to the dash tag and so gets a nice little push. Hold a vote for the... Uh, no one actually comes. This is the lowest turnout we've had in a while, but I think that's almost entirely because the big monthly is coming up this Saturday. Be there or be square. You have a chance to warm up for NFA 2 and be in a cramped dojo. It's not actually that cramped. But it always is when the monthlies roll around. So we violate fire code. 
Yeah, I guarantee you we're by. We've got like a million people in a tiny room and there's that big fireplace going. And all we gotta stop asking dojo participants to wear flammable clothing, but Jaden insists. Aw, oh, slave in the Saturday. Oh man, it's gonna be tight. I'm gonna order pizza for the entire venue, but only I get to eat it. I actually might do that, I don't know. If I feel like fucking around and waste all my money. No, no, dude, like like how many how many pizza boxes do you think would feed 20 by people? Ten. Five pizzas? That's only if I s that's yeah, that's if I ins and put in the uh, Hitler rules where everybody gets one slice. That's all you get. Ooh, nice bear to shield. Please, please. You gonna roll on? Yes, he will. And Steven off to an early lead here in this uh, game two, but you know the, fi the fire transformation kind of invites Fox to come in and get down smashed. Ledge dash wasn't perfect, but this is what happens when you play DK all day, I guess. Oh, okay. I could have dash attacked that. I think that was a dash attack. I, I really doubt he meant to put it forward to me. Oh, 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 oh! He's gonna float and air dodge, yep. Wow, really good comeback so far by Jay Walker. He finally gets out of it with his back air. Steven desperately tracking the center of the stage. And, ooh, gets the nair on the platform. Really nice. And slap. They said he's been more interested in integrating more aggressive offstage fares, and that's definitely one of them. It's a hard read to get the ledge. It looked really close. I, I was surprised he actually hit the fares. So not a bad... No, you say you're not the worst peach in Texas. I play worse. Sorry. You're going to have to just hold that title of being kind of mediocre. Actually, last time we played, you were doing pretty fucking good. So maybe you're on the come-up. Like everybody else here. Just come-up city. I played peaches that their whole goal in life was to just dash tag down smash and they won tournament matches that way. And then they talked about how good they were at it. I'm just like, yeah, I mean, go, go for it, dude. Does it get the clip up tilt? Does it quite hit it? Hey, you want to take over for a second? I have to go pee up here, buddy. Yeah, but it's something Steven can't do, so... If Steven wins this game on Pokemon, I swear he's winning the set. But that's how you lose the set on Pokemon, or the game on Pokemon, is you, uh, you get burned by Fox. Just ask Mockmaster69 about that. Yep. L-O-L. Haha. -ha. Hey, guess what? Steven! You just lost on Stadium because you got burnt by Fox. That's a C-Stat special, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so... Did I turn it too low? Can you even... Oh, you can. It's so low. A little higher. How about there? Oh, right there. Oh, yeah, that's that's the stuff. All right, so. Jamie's off to a pretty all right start here on Fountain of Dreams. The worst legal stage in the game. Up smash on Peach's shield is literally never, ever, 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 ever safe. Testing, testing. Hey, it's your boy Worth here to tell you to up smash Peach's shield all day just to show her that she can't get away with that shit. All right? <laughs> Sometimes she, you gotta do unsafe things. Literally always near you. I'm trying to mango this bitch up, you know what I'm saying? Oh, good. So you left? Mm -hmm. And Steven was about to win the, the game the on game. Pokey. Yeah, I think I burned. And I was like, yeah. And I was like, if, if he wins this game, he's winning the set, hands down. And yeah, that, that's, that's it, a great and momentum. And basically, yeah. it's over. So Jamie's all the way now. You think Stadium is the hardest counter pick in the matchup? Probably. Yeah, that's that's rough. So it, that would have been a huge to win there. All right, so Steven doing a little dash dancing, getting chip damage off the bare nair. Ah, really? Luigi does blow, uh, but 
we have a ranked Luigi at number five, actually. Yeah. Good for John. I actually don't even mind uh, because John, first of all, is amazing. Second of all, uh, Lu Luigi's going to do better at nationals than your average uh, just like Marth, Fox. Yeah. Our Fox, yeah. Not even nationals, just regionals. On average. And it's it called matchup knowledge. Matchup knowledge, yeah. Get actually, it here. I actually finally have gotten to the point where I'm confident against Luigi's. I remember I had to play Studebaker, who's a fantastic Luigi from DFW at uh, CCC, and I was just like, oh, well, you know. I've got John. He's got John, yeah, and, it, and it's not a fun. Ooh, that was a disgusting fair. Uh, like, one of the things is, you know, Spencer came down and kind of bopped a bunch of people in Houston. It's like, well, we don't have bananas to play every yeah. single week in and, in, you know, at four different weeklies. Oh, that up there was so good. Yeah, dude. Uh, I love Spencer. I'm not even going to. But, yeah, Spencer definitely came back down and cleaned up. We don't have ICs here, do we? Right. Tap City. Tap City is left. MIA. Where's he at? College? He's college, and he doesn't even really play up there. Alex. Uh, oh, the, the king of the ICs. Alex, give me that Mora. Follow him on. Give me that Mora. <laughs> follow him at uh, uh, Sackboy God. So he, uh, you know, left like two years ago at this point. Yeah. Or he, no, dude, he went to CSAT like maybe, maybe even. I'm going to put it on. Put it down. Give me is, is the coolest ice climber three. ever. This man does not wobble. <laughs> this man runs tournaments. This man has a cute mustache. What else do you want out of your ices? Plays the nice green skin. Yeah, so we didn't. Soy we haven't. Cat. We haven't had Alex for three years. No, Tap Alex. City. We haven't had for a year and a half. And so everybody forgot what to do. <laughs> Spencer showed up and we were like, "Crap." Well, Luigi's getting his his reads. Quantum Rocker. His combos are really pretty easy actually to do. So it always looks like the Luigi, if he's winning, he's beating ass. I, I would say most people can pick up Luigi and learn a lot of his combos like uh, in about two or three days just because of how streamlined all of his smashes are together. He's got an amazing up tilt and air. So when Luigi's on point, it looks like, oh my god, it's unwinnable for everyone who's playing. Especially the spacies too, because he opens them up hard. Uh, I thought he was going to go for the up there. doesn't hit it, though. Uh, also, is it Jay Walker 2-1 uh, or is it Blues Blues 2-1? 2-1 Blues Blues. 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 Okay, cool. Sorry about that, boys. Doesn't wobble. Uh, uh, he doesn't wobble anymore because he keeps dropping it. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he, he kept dropping. He, he, he dropped might, it so he might many try times. to wobble sometimes, but they're just dropped. So basically, he doesn't wobble. <laughs> I tried to wobble and I dropped it. So I'm like, oh, I guess I, all this alpha male testosterone is impeding my ability to hit 200 BPMs. Yep. My friend, who's a drummer, like did it the first time he tried. Yeah. He's like, oh, is this all it is? This is really easy, and he doesn't even play melee like at all. Right. He's just like, oh, I thought this was like really hard or something, but no, anyone can do this. <laughs> I was laughing. So this one's this is kind of just a cleanup game for Jay Walker. Try to learn some knowledge. Oh, okay. Ooh, go, go pick go, it up. Go, go you get it. He taunts. He taunted. Uh, he yeah. Kill yourself. Well, he probably knows Steven. that he really You're can't win this game short of a miracle gimp. Oh, a miracle gimp. No. I mean, he's trying. Those are some fishy back there. Yeah, he's, he's like, trying, Please. man. This is a big one. Back throw but in the center of the stage, though, is definitely not the right choice. No, no, no. If it was Pikachu, that'd be a great choice. You could sure. be on the other side of the fucking stage and back throw Pikachu. <laughs> and you'd be fine. He's got the little uh, Ken Masters throw, too. It's like... Yeah. I played some Street Fighter Three at an arcade uh, last week. I didn't go to Cytex because I was playing mini golf, and they had an arcade there. Right. And I was playing some Street Fighter. Uh, I'm terrible. I've never played a... a t Traditional fighting game outside of four, uh, Street Fighter Four, where I played Fei Long. But is Fei Long cheap? I feel like it's cheap. I have no idea. Because I picked them up and I was like, oh, this moves good. He probably was at one incarnation. But I really just like Bruce Lee characters. So. Also, this is a big balls pick by Steven. He says, I want close quarters. You cannot camp me. Which is true. This is the the stage is promotes fair play. No, it doesn't. It's <laughs> no, so it's, good it's, for Fox. It's so good for Fox. But at the very least, he can't camp you. Uh, outside of invincibility camping and platform camping, if he does it fast and also just beating you. So, really not a good pick for Peach, but he's got a lead. He's looking for the big damage. There it is. Ooh, CC down. Less. What? What? Thanks, PC. Uh, oh, I'm sorry about that, dude. Was the turnout okay, you say? Oh, uh, no. His, yeah, yeah, but the his turnout, PC, the PC died. died. Oh. Sad. So, uh... We're taking a hiatus from Cytex right now? There. 
any any fox that loses to floaties on this stage is just like lasering's great and all, but, but like so you are don't, all you your don't, other moves. no 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 you <laughs> don't have to just laser you laser to just tack on extra damage and force the floaty to like also not camp, right? Yeah. So if they're just trying to be pure aggro, you just say, all right, well, then I just beat you, right? Because the only reason you really laser is to make them come in. And if they're doing that on their own, then like, okay, thanks. You die at 50 here. Peace. You know? Cool, I'll get a rematch in mage. Just down tilt. Yeah, just down tilt. Down tilt, Peach, trying to parasol. It's amazing. It's so sick. <sighs> Midge versus Worth. It's going to be a fun one. But first, we got to get through this one. And, oh, goes for a little late yeah, on the dash Yeah, he should have just grabbed at that point. Like, also, wait. he could have down smashed. It would have been crazy. Oh, Fox sneaks under. And just like that, he's going to open up all his damage. He gets to smash the eye out. Oh, my God. His you and you. A super weak bear. Super weak dash tech. All these just regular get-ups are really throwing off Steven's timing on the punish. Uh, up air and now. Good DI nice. is going to cover the ledge of the turnip. No, actually, he doesn't quite make it, unfortunately. Yeah, bad angle. Bad angle. I got it. Oh, the degeneracy. A good defensive hold by Steven just saying, hey, I got the stage. That was such a bad nair from the plat. Holy goodness. Stage is good for Peach. I, th I actually don't think it's bad for Peach. It's just Fox is really scary here. And now it's just all up to Steve to close it out. Yes. Yeah. Now he's going to be in your grand finals. It's Fox and Mark. All right. Yeah. Yeah. 